on top of the stars. Never thought we'd ever get this far. We live for moments like this. We come alive in moments like this. Here we are. This is a time like a dream coming to life. We live for moments like this. We come alive. got diagnosed with DMDD. I kind of felt different, like if something was wrong with me. I used to not do the things that I love because of how I felt what people would think about me. And I learned that I can do anything that I want to if I keep on. It broke my heart, but I knew I needed to do it. I knew I needed to find help. And honestly, it has been a blessing. Both of the girls experienced substantial trauma. They were witness to domestic abuse. There was food insecurity. So for a long time, especially Cody, she used to slam her head against walls. She used to try to kick doors down. Raising children with these types of needs feels impossible. I don't even think I knew how much we were missing until we got here. I enjoy the monumental impact this job can have and things that we see every day like new words or toilet training and whatever that looks like for that individual family, there's a big impact that we can make. In Greensboro, I couldn't afford to live as comfortably as I live here, so it's just a, a blessing. Right now, I have one appointment a month at a um, psychiatrist. I got to decide whether I'm going to catch a taxi, whether I'm going to catch a bus. You know how long it takes to have a, a heart pressure, metabolism, all this kind of thing, just to go to one appointment. It's a real delicate situation, physical and mental. This helps you with that. I support Easter Seals so they can continue to support people with disabilities, like my son. I support Easter Seals because they help so many people in so many ways throughout their entire lifetime. I donate at the President's Council level because I want to feel connected to the miracle moments experienced by the children, adults, and families we serve every day. Únete a mí.